um, hello guys. Today I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna show you how to play Mugen. I just like decided to make this video because you know there's a uh, like some people that didn't really know Mugen. They just kind of like watch my video and ask me where to download uh, this game. And I also decided to make this video because because like like there's uh, there's a lot of like tutorials out there. There's a lot of tutorials out there that just doesn't really teach you th uh, that much about Mugen, like how to work around with it, how to con set the controls for the games. So. Yeah, I just um, wanted to show uh, like those people that watching my vids how to play Mugen themselves, since some of them asked me like, how to like how to play it or how to fix the stuff that they just encounter when f first play Mugen. All right, I'm just jump straight in to the point. So. So like, if you wanted to download Mugen, there's uh, like three types of Mugen. Mugen 1.1, Mugen 1.0, with Mugen Plus. Um, the, the newer the version, the, the, the higher quality is, the more higher quality is the game. Like 1.1 is like, like, it has like HD, like kind of like HD fine game, like Mugen is like an engine where you download characters made by other people. It's not like a phone game where you can just like download, like just download, and there's a like already characters inside the game. So you have to like find the characters on the internet to download them. So this is like So I'm just gonna split uh into two types of Mugen. 1.1 and 1.0 is for people that just want like a casual like casual fighting game characters in, in here. When Mugen Plus is for like overpowered characters if you have seen my channel. You can find them on Google, like pretty easily. Just search like Mugen download. And you you will really have it. But I but I will put like like links uh down in the description for so you don't really have to like go into shady so you might not have to like go into shady websites and to download and might accidentally accidentally download virus game banana game banana is totally safe don't worry okay and how do how do you find characters okay finding characters are uh, is not really that hard if you have watched uh, my how to find characters video, well, the with that video is just like, like a t th that video is like about how to find OP characters, but it it's pretty much uh, it's like like the methods to find like normal characters are also like pretty similar, so. I recommend you watch that video of mine. But yeah, for but I would just say this is like for the so now I would do so now I do this for the the casual like for anyone that's like casual in it like don't really want overpowered characters in the Mugen. You can. 
follow these methods. Uh, Morgan free for all. You can you can go in here and find characters in here. Uh, and select uh like the series like that you want to like add in your Morgan. Like, you know, any animes or fighting games. Uh like multiplayer, calf or whatever, Street Fighter. You can also go to like Mugen database. Uh, this page should have like characters in here. Just go in here and select like the categories of here categories. You can find like a bunch of characters here. They I think they pretty much like leave links to down to the downloads. Like uh, here, let me just give you links in here. To download like any like uh, like uh, any normal characters, okay. You can also find them on YouTube. It's pretty much easy. Okay, just search whatever like Morgan Mario download. Let's see. Well, most of the time um, it will just be like just. Uh, if anyone likes that, well, if you don't like chess, uh, you can find them on database or movie feature. Or, uh, these are the methods that don't require you to register into any website. But if you really want like more characters, you can watch like me out of it. Okay, two. Okay, now the next. Uh, next, how to, how to add characters. So yeah. So I will just do this. Okay. When you have download the characters, they will always like inside a zip file. You have to extract them. So before you extract the zip file, uh, check inside the zip file. If like the characters is in the in a file, so if it is, you can just like. Uh, extract here so you can have it here and then you also have to check the def, def name like, like this one like the def uh, let's check if the def name of the character is matched with the file name like gaming uh, slash and uh, uh, like below, no, no, yeah, uh, like that. Then you just like control X, uh, go to Mugen, go to Charles, control V. Now you want to re rename it, uh, control C. Uh, cop copy the name. Go to data, data. Go to select def. Go to select def. Scroll down. Uh, ignore all these wall of text. To the line, insert your characters below. Uh, just enter. Control V. Control X. Save. Save it. Control V is like paste. Paste it here. So now you go into your Morgan EXE. See? So, round one. Okay, so. Oh, for characters that don't have a file in the zip. Uh, you have to like. So this is why I say that you have to check in every zip file. Uh, for characters that like don't have a file. So if you extract it, 
like right now, like it's right here. It's all gonna be like messed up. See? So let me just like delete all of this real quick. So for characters like these, where the author just like <laughs> didn't put a file for some reason, you have to like extract to the f the zip name, like extract to remove period. Uh, that is like the zip name. Uh, So it will like create a file with the same name as a zip and put it in there. See, now uh, you can uh, just repeat the process. Put it in the Charles file. Go to data. Select the. I forgot to copy the name. Should be here. Okay, and now for the last variant of the character. So I have already extracted here, but as you can see, the like the file name is not. Like exactly like the def definite. So if I didn't rename it and put it in here, the character will not show up. See, oh, uh, wait a minute. Oh, yeah, the character will not show up. I accidentally deleted uh, uh, her name. Uh, the character will not appear. So if anyone got this problem, all you need to do is go to the files, um, open up your select dev, and then go here, slash, you need to put like a slash here, and then copy, copy the dev that you want to use uh, in the file. Uh, Control V, paste it here. Dot dev. Then it, it will like search for the the dev inside this like the file name here. So if you don't like if the dev is different from the file name, it will try to find the dev with the same name as the file name and uh, but it w will fail because there isn't any dev that it. So you have the same name as the file name. So if you do that, you can see he's here. See? Okay. Okay, now for the movie controls. Go to options. Uh, by the way, I'm, I know that I'm using WinMogen, but it should be like the same for Mugen 1.0 and 1.1. Uh, the tutorials will be the same, because they all work the same. Go to Input Controls, go to Key Configs, uh, select uh, the, the play one if you like like play Mugen alone or you can you can fix uh, uh, play two if you want to 
uh, like play with your siblings. So just like press enter. Uh, what's the time? Enter. We will work because it's like 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 you can you know like most of the key won't work, but enter will won't work when you first download the again because like the key binds are like is it messy you have to uh, press enter so now up down left right up arrow down arrow left arrow right uh you can config the buttons however you like this is my like prefer key binds cxcv asd now press escape Okay, so if you want to, okay, now for the palette, if you want to select one to six, uh, you want to select like like one to six, uh, one to six piece piece mean like palette palette number one to six, um. Uh, you just uh, like press Z for one, X two, like A B one two, A B C, X Y Z, Z is like one two three four five six P. So, but if you want to select your character as like seven P or above, just hold the stop button, hold the D the D button, a diagram config. Uh, so hold the stop button. And your A B C X Y Z will become uh, seven to twelve P. Okay, now next on to how to find stages. Uh, that's just like you can just use like the same methods that I have used to find a chart. You can find stages here too. Uh, just go. You know, just like look in database stages. And you will have these. You can search Morgan Free for our stages. You can search in YouTube. Like Morgan Stages download. Uh see someone will make a play playlist. Um but if you want to find like check actual good stages, uh you you have to like go to AK1 Morgan AK1 Morgan stages, uh, such stages in here uh, Morgan archive, all kinds of stuff uh, You would have to like Watch my, my other like My other how to find characters video Okay, so now Oh, and how to add stages That's let me just wrap, wrap a stage that I have in my other Morgan. Okay, so When you download a stage, it will be inside a zip file like this. Uh, if it's inside a file, you have to you have to take it out uh, and put it like this. You know, put it like this. Then just like Control X, go to stages, put it in here. When you have the stage, uh, go to here. Do you select dev? Uh, 
go to the the line that have like extra extra stages. Enter type stages slash copy the the name of the dev paste it control V dot dev uh, control X save now the stage uh, should be in here Round one, fight. So yeah, that's it for the stage. Okay, uh, I think we are pretty much done on how to like grab, like, how to like play Mugen and download it. But there are some stuff that might help you like the like your Mugen might crash sometimes and the the so this is just like a bonus part in the vi in this way I'm I'm just gonna show you how to like fix some stuff. Uh if your Mugen is like having errors uh, when you download the the charts and or something. So, if you like have like problems uh, running Mugen, like it's laggy. Uh, first reason might be because your system isn't good. Like if you're running Windows Seven or Windows Eight, I guess uh it will um like usually like very laggy. Uh, you need a a good system like Windows Ten or Eleven to run high quality characters or stages. Um the second re uh, reason why your Mugen might crash is because like the character won't work uh if you put them in the wrong version of Mugen. So if you want to check if the characters you download is compatible with your Mugen, just like go in here, go to the dev, look for the Mugen version or version version date. <laughs> um, no, no, go in the Mugen version. If it's like 2002 or 2004, uh, it should be, <coughs> it should be like the Win Mugen. If it's like 2000, uh, 2014, 13 or something, it will. It probably be like a Mugen 1.0 or above. Well, I mean, if you, if it like, if it, if it's in the wrong version and it crash, it will tell you like like this character is in the wrong version, so you would know anyways. I'm just telling you. Uh, how to fix it? Uh, like how to check? Uh, how to check the character version? So. Um, okay, the next part is 4 gigabyte patch. Uh, this, um, like, you might, like, download, like, a very heavy character, that's uh, about, like, like, if you have downloaded heavy characters, like, about 300 megabytes or above, it might crash. The, the game because like the effects are too pretty or something so I will just um like there's a way to fix it just go into this website a uh, call four gig four gigabyte patch it will make you a Mugen like Where is it? Uh, four gigabyte patch. Extracted here. Uh, run it. Yes. Click yes. Okay. Choose 
your exe the woman exe let's open okay your Morgan uh, uh this might help you this might help your Morgan burn like more high quality characters so if you are running characters like this like characters that have like a lot of effects or like What the f I don't know. Uh, it should work like this. Like, I don't know why that crashed, but it should work like this. Like, if you run like a very heavy character, uh, and you have the four foot get by passion. It well, uh, like, like the game should be able to run. I would just select like, the same matchup, see if it crash. Yeah, so this is just like a matchup thing. Uh, the character, like, he should work properly fine. Uh, some of these OP shot, you know, it's high, uh, crash. So. Uh, that's level 4. Like, what's probably fine. Round one. Fight. Need, like these effects. Uh, yeah. So if you download those kind of characters, you will need the like, the four gigabyte patch. Okay. Oh, next. Oh yes. Now we have to like go to the Morgan config. Uh, you might have to like change your Morgan uh, dot config. Um, well, you don't have to do this if you are in one point zero or one point one. But uh, if you're in WinMorgan and play with OP characters, uh, you might have to change it. Change it a little bit. Uh, just like. Uh, go here. Uh, I'll just pick this as an example. Yeah, see? Right. Just please set, like, you have to set these. Uh, uh, I have to set uh, these like these settings to uh, that to like, be able to run characters that can like spawn a lot of sprites uh, or a lot of helpers or projectiles or whatever. So you just go in here, go to data. Uh, if you're playing with OP charts, um, you will. Uh, this this is just for anyone that's going to play with OP characters. Oh, by the way, you can set uh, your Morgan size in here. Okay, then you have to go to... Uh, where is it? Here it is. Like layer spike, layer spike three thousand. You can set it higher. Like the more you, the higher you set it, uh, uh, like the less restriction the Morgan uh will do to to let the charts like spawn more projectiles and stuff. Yeah, you can set these like from projectile. Play your projectile max to draw shadows. Like uh, from here to here, you can set them on a on a, a high number to run these kind of characters. Yeah. 
See, uh, you can like, change your movie size in there. Um, and by the way, if you want to full screen, uh, just press Alt Enter. Oh, you can Alt Enter. Uh, in women, you you should be able to Alt Enter in one point zero and one point one. But in women again, it have to be like the default settings of this, like. Like 640, 4, 480. This have to be like the default width and height, like that to oh, enter. Uh, I forgot to save it. Oh, enter. See, yeah. Uh, this is just for like characters that are uh, just like somehow just doesn't work. The next method is for like characters that just like run on Japanese or Chinese system. So you have just have to like change uh, your computer region. Uh, Just like only do this if you have like a lot of characters that uh, uh like have code written in Japanese or Chinese. Um yeah, if you like really just like really want to run them, you you will have to change your computer region. Okay, how to get stream packs, uh same same with the finding charts and stages and method. So yeah, there it is. Uh, I hope you could build your own mugging and collect, like build your own collections. Oh, and yeah, see. Ya.